Hello friends and greetings for the day. Welcome back to another episode of Technical Vocabulary where we learn meaning and definition of several technical words. As a part of today's episode, we are taking another important term called as test environment. And this option will tell you that what exactly is the infrastructure required in order to conduct testing. The test environment basically consists of the setup and infrastructure put together required to test a particular application. The environment does not just limit to a particular computer with an operating system. It may sometimes require basic configurations as well, like what kind of other softwares are required to be associated, what kind of interface is required to be associated, what kind of connectivity, network requirements you need to have, and definitely the database parts as well. In case you're trying to uh, test different levels of testing, the environment may vary depending on the need of the level and it will be completely different from one another. Number one thing to remember here from the test environment point of view that depending on certain phases as well for some of the products like ERP products or Salesforce, you may have different orgs altogether to test it because dev org is different than the testing org and then the production. So you may have further differentiation between the environments which are basically used to do test the application and validate them. Now, if we try to do a quick deeper dive with an example of environment, an environment basically makes use of a test environment. And the reason we call it as test environment because some of the requirements will be shared with you. And based on that, the requirement for the infrastructure in order to run that test will be also determined. Initially, we set up the and design the environment which is required to run those tests, which includes the hardware, software, necessary web services, or any other applications to be there as a part of it, which might be interacting with the product to make it happen. So you completely analyze a particular transaction or an activity or process which you want to perform. And you see that what are those things which might be required in order to run this test like a real user. And then you conduct these tests. But for example, when you go to, uh, you know, from functional to non-functional testing, and you talk about performance testing, you talk about security testing, the environments are uniquely created for these levels. It's not mandatory. The environment what you use in functional testing would be equally the same, which is required for non-functional performance, security, or usability testing. So that's where a team has to recognize the need of test environment and define them according to the level being conducted. And also, whether it is at the test levels or these are in the production, so environment might be slightly further different than what you have used right now. So test environment put together is the interface or infrastructure or setup which is required to run a test to validate the application functionalities and features. It could be functional or non-functional features of the application. It's just that to meet the right expected environment which is required to validate it. So that's all from this particular tutorial team. Should you have anything else in terms of words and questions, please drop them in the chat below. I'm always there to assist you and help you with the right answer there. So till then, keep learning, keep exploring, keep understanding the context. Thanks for watching the video team and happy learning.